Hey watchers, Will here with another Avengers video for you. And today we're talking about death. No, not Lady Death, the cosmic entity. Think more so the untimely demise of something once loved, like the ending to Firefly or Gamora off that cliff. Before we move forward, as expected, spoilers ahead for the recently released Avengers Infinity War. So, you may be asking yourselves why we're focusing on the doom and gloom in this video. Well, it has to do with some recent comments made by the writers for Infinity War. For some time, fans of the MCU as a franchise have been speculating how the snap felt across the galaxy will manage to be undone, and with it, someone being confirmed by the Russo some time ago that multiple realities will most likely not play a role. From there, everyone immediately goes to, oh, well, time travel will save them. Well, apparently that may not apply to everyone. The writers for Infinity War, Christopher Marcus and Stephen McFeely, in a recent interview with BuzzFeed of all resources, describe how the follow-up film is not a guaranteed return for every character lost. Marcus states, Avengers 4 doesn't do what you think it does. It is a different movie than you think it is. Also, the deaths are real. I just want to tell you, it's real, and the sooner you accept that, the sooner you will be able to move on to the next stage of grief. McFeely adds his own thoughts when he follows, saying, Put it this way. I think Infinity War is a fairly mature movie for a blockbuster. It's got a lot of fun in it, obviously, but boy, it gets very mature. The second one is also mature. We're going to own these choices and hopefully surprise and delight you and get you invested. It's by the same studio, the same filmmaking team, they were written at the same time, shot at the same time, they're clearly connected, but they are definitely two different movies, one of which is dependent on what happened previous. Marcus finishes by saying, we broke your heart, now we're going to blow your mind. Now, granted during the interview they are clearly having fun discussing this kind of somber reaction that was had by theater goes after Infinity War. I know in my own theater there was a kind of stunned and shocked silence initially. But Avengers 4 aims to not only continue the story, but take us through a different journey with these characters we have grown to know and love over the past 10 years. So hopefully it does live up to its mind-blowing claims. Still, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Who do you think may not return post Avengers 4? Personally, I think they may just leave Gamora where she is, and I think Loki and Heimdall are almost surely gone for good. While you're there, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Hit that bell to be updated of future content and check out our website for more. I'm Will, and have a nice day.